and let's get after our next day of Murph prep. A uh, couple announcements. Please consider becoming a vintage super fan. Click the join button next to the subscribe button on this video. Uh, support the channel for $2.99 a month. That's less than a cup of coffee and it helps us a ton. Also consider the Fundamentals of Nutrition program with Coach Carly. Weekly check-ins, monthly goal setting, and um, app to use an app to log your nutrition and get feedback. Okay, we have our Murph prep going today. We're gonna start off the rower. Let's hop off the rower, Carly. Warm up is going to be a few quick rounds, three quick rounds of five inchworm push-ups. Okay. Hinge at the hips, place your hands on the floor, walk your hands into a plank, and then perform one push-up and walk your hands back. Okay. Five of those into 10 mountain climber to stretch. So big step forward, then reach up overhead as you rotate, okay? Alternating sides, 10 total. And then finally stand up and knock out 15 air squats. Pretend these are heavy back squats, guys. Every rep counts and makes you better if you try to perform them well. Keep your weight balanced in the middle of the foot. Push the knees out to track over the toes and keep the midline engaged as you pass through your full depth, okay? Three rounds of the warm-up. Okay, we have Memorial Day Murph coming up in just a few weeks, so let's hit a longer uh, conditioning effort today. We're gonna do two sets going every 20 minutes. You're gonna start with a one mile run, so go for a nice aggressive pace jog. And then when you get back, 100 feet of walking lunges. Gently touch the trailing knee to the floor. It's up to you if you want to step through at the top of the lunge or step together between each step, okay? 100 feet, followed by 50 push-ups for guys, 40 push-ups for the ladies. With this high quantity, it's a good time to practice um, what kind of set you're able to hit consistently. Rather than burning out and doing a giant set to open up and then going to doubles or singles, find a consistent number that you can hit with minimal rest and then go back into 100 feet of walking lunges. And then finally, we'll finish up with another, or sorry, with a row. Finish up with the rower, 500 meters for the gentlemen, 425 meters for the ladies. Uh, be aggressive on this because this is gonna end out the round. So let's try to pick up the tempo throughout that whole, you know, 90 seconds to two minutes on the rower. If you don't have access to a rower, simply substitute a 400 meter run instead of the row portion of this workout.